What is going on you guys, this is Tech HD coming at you with a brand new video and today I'm going to be showing you guys the best screen recorder for Android devices. Now this is the one without any roots or anything like that and a couple videos ago I showed you guys how to record your mobile phone with this little adapter, this micro USB to HDMI uh, converter and then you hook it up to your capture card and but like it's a lot it's a lot of money because you need a capture card which is like a good 150 bucks then you need the converter which is like a good 30 bucks and then you need like an HDMI my cable and it's a long setup and if you want to record like audio and stuff like that you need the Elgato chat link cable because it cuts off the audio when you hook up a headphone stuff like that so it's like a long process and a lot of money to spend if you don't have the equipment so I'm gonna be showing you guys the second best thing and that is a screen recorder and this is the one that I currently use and out of all the ones that I've used this is like the best one it has so many features you can edit your video you could trim it you can do so many things and you can see right here I just open it and there's like a little camera right here and it shows you option and if we click on the one with the four squares you can see that you have like your folder with um, uh, the videos uh, pictures that you took like screen captures and then the settings so the video resolution all depends on your screen resolution what's capable of mine is capable of 2k which is 1440p so obviously I put that the video quality is 12 megapixels uh, per second and then the FPS it depends on your phone as well so I go to 60 frames per second I hide the record window when record I shake my phone to stop the recording that's a cool feature you record your audio which is really cool you can show the touches like um, basically like it does like a little circle where, where you're exactly touching uh, not close app when you exit the floating window you could add a watermark which is just do you recording if you like obviously I don't you have a countdown on when to start the recording it's so many cool features and I think it's really I think it's really cool and what's really interesting is that you can have your camera right here as you can see on the top left I have a camera right there and obviously you can move it you could you could definitely uh, scale it make it a lot larger you can move it down here or somewhere um, depending on what you prefer basically you could take a picture and then it'll show see that I took it but basically let me just move that and um, you can start recording so we're going to try this out, I'm going to show you guys how it is. And we're just going to go to the home menu. You can see that it shows the touches. What is going on you guys, this is Tech HD coming at you with a brand new video and you can see that I'm just moving around, give me a second. And it takes a while but I'm doing like multiple things. I have like, I'm recording through my, uh, through the capture card and then I'm recording through this. So obviously it's going to be a little bit uh, buffy but we could just go to like multiple devices. I could show you certain things. And um, obviously it's recording the audio, it's recording the video, and it's recording through my camera, which is really helpful if you guys don't have a camera like what I do to set it up. And I think it's really cool. And so then what I do is I just stop the recording and then it stops. And then you can see right here, I could watch it, I could share it, or I could just delete it. We could watch it very quickly. And then I think we could edit it as well on the top right. And then you can see it has its own little edit video. You could trim multiple things. You could remove the middle. You could add music if you want to from your playlist. It's really cool. It's really helpful. So let me just actually let me just remove this very quickly so it doesn't bother you guys. Um, so we could just add like different types of music. Doesn't matter. I don't, I'm just gonna put a hype background music. And then you could do the you could lower the volume of the music. I like to lower it like around here, so it's like a nice background music. And then the audio of the microphone of yours, you can preview it. And then I'll just hit confirm, and I'll save that. This video is being saved. There's like a lot of cool features into this, and I think it's really helpful if you guys want to play like mobile games, stuff like that. And uh, let me show you another thing. Let me just remove that, and it's this one. We're gonna delete that screenshot, and we're also gonna edit. Because we added the music, we're gonna remove the middle, and remove like right here, and then it'll be saving it. And then you could just transfer it over to your computer, and then you can edit it however you want. You could remove the microphone of what your camera was catching your voice, and then replace it with the microphone that you were actually recording. Um, maybe you have like a better camera, you don't have to use your phone's camera, you could replace it with the other camera. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys a preview of me using the screen recorder and let me know what you guys think about it. Alright you guys, so here's a quick example of me just using uh, the app and it's pretty 
pretty easy. It's not hard whatsoever. I could just go on Amazon right now. I'm using the camera right now. I'm using the uh, the phone's microphone, but then I can easily replace it with uh, a microphone that I have and easily just sync the audio, stuff like that. This audio quality is not as great. It's not hard whatsoever. And we're just going on Amazon right now. I could be shopping something. I could be showing you guys something something on my wish list or anything like that i want to get like a new laptop i want to get the razor blade stuff like that like so i can continue editing when i'm traveling maybe i want to get a sticker put that on my pc uh maybe i'm looking for a new chair for my unboxing setup S stuff like that like you know i could just show you guys multiple things multiple videos all of that uh stuff on my phone we could play a game if we want so you guys just saw an example of how the screen recorder works, how it, the audio sounds like, how the camera sounds like, how it, how the quality of the screen recording is, and it's actually pretty interesting. Now the only con I can think about this is if you guys care about quality, uh, that's why I record using the converter and using the capture card because my capture card records up to 40 megabits per second, and this using the screen recorder using an app it records up to 12 megabits per second so of course that quality is a little bit lower but other otherwise it's not that bad and mine is recording at 1440p so like you could definitely scale it down to like 1080 or 720 and then that makes the quality a lot better which is really cool the frames per second 60 frames per second that's like the best possible on youtube which is honestly insane you can shake that phone you can record audio maybe you don't uh you can show the touches all of that and you can replace the audio with the microphone which is really cool so there you guys have it i hope you guys enjoyed the video it'll be down in the description below if you guys want to check it out i hope you guys enjoyed the video please like comment subscribe let me know down in the comments below on what you guys think about this software let me know what you guys think about the app if it's really helpful if it's really good for those of you guys that want to make youtube videos on your mobile phone so let me know down in the comments below i hope you guys enjoyed the video please like comment subscribe follow me on facebook twitter youtube instagram and twitch as always it's tech hd i'll catch you guys in the next video peace Thank you.